What's up guys, Chuck here. Let's talk about the Black Frontier, Frontier Shrine stage. To start, let's go over the lineup. Since all enemies for this stage are black, we'll primarily use cats that work well against black enemies. The first three cats are meat shields. For these cats, we'll use two eraser cats and Jiangxi. The fourth cat, Bomber Cat, is the most important since he has the freeze ability. We'll use Pizza Cat due to the relatively low cost, which makes him great for holding back enemies early in the stage. It is un unlikely that you have the same uber shown in this lineup, so you will need to search through your cats using a filter to fill the remaining slots. Filter your search for ubers that are strong against black enemies. The strong against icon is a picture of a boxing glove. After moving those cats into your lineup, do another search, this time filtering for ubers that have massive damage against black enemies. The massive damage icon is a picture of a lightning bolt. If you have immortal Nobunaga, use him for an additional freeze. This cat is not required for this strategy to work, so don't worry if you don't have him. As for your cannon, Thunderbolt is a great option for the additional freeze effect. When the battle begins, we will take it slow as we level up Worker Cat and save cash. Send out a few Eraser Cats to delay the enemies from reaching the base. When the doges start to stack up, send out Pizza Cat to finish them off. Make sure you don't push out too hard since we want to delay the fight for a while. The tough enemies will spawn when the base is hit. Let's speed things up just a bit while we level up Worker Cat. It's okay to let Pizza Cat die, since this will allow us to delay the fight a bit longer. After Pizza Cat dies, send out Eraser to keep the doge off the base. Spamming Eraser should allow you to hold off 2-3 to three doges before needing to send out another Pizza Cat. Let's speed up the video again as we stockpile some more cash. Now that Worker Cat is at level 8, the max level, and cash is maxed out, it's time to start sending out Ubers. If you have any fast moving Ubers, send those out last to allow time for all cats to reach the base at the same time. From this point on, you want to make sure you're spawning the first 4 cats in the first row every time they are available. If you are low on cash, prioritize Bomber Cat and Manic Eraser. Wait to use Thunderbolt Cannon until the Razorback reaches the front line. This will make it easier for the Bomber Cats to start chain freezing the Razorback. If you are short on cash, hold off on spawning more Pizza Cats until all Ubers have been sent out. After all Ubers are out, you will have plenty of cash to spam any cat that is available. I'll also speed up the last part of the video since there's not much to do here besides smashing your keyboard. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if this strategy worked for you. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.